Doug, what's your take on the whole Epstein affair? I'd like to know, you know, who his pals were, who was riding on the plane, what they were doing there on the plane and on that island. I'd like to see the videotapes. I'd like people to know about these things to talk about it because it would unmask the corruption and the degraded behavior of the people that rule the world. So that's what I'd like. And that's what I think. Chances of that coming out, very slim. Anybody that tries to bring that out, probably signing his own death warrant. Yeah, I think so. I think for a lot of people, actually, the whole Epstein affair was probably a big wake up call to how corrupt the systems were. That this guy was arrested for it, commits suicide and in, in jail. And then, uh, of course, uh, Ghislaine gets convicted, but you know, none of the customers, none of the client list is ever released. There's never any information about it. The way it was all just so massively suppressed, it was like, I mean, it's if you think that we live in a society where law and order is, uh, you know, applied universally and it's a fair system, then I think this probably scared you straight. I hope. Laughable. Of course it's not. Of course it's not. I mean, if, if you're the ruler or high up on the pecking order, I mean, there's all kinds of pressure you can put on little people below you to leave you alone. I mean, and few people are that brave that they want to take their property or their lives in their hands to uh, run counter to that. I mean, accidents happen. People that are, uh, this is getting very serious. It's always been a problem, but now, you know, it's getting more serious than ever.